25 years, I've seen stupid ass deals. Stupid. I mean, muni bond deals where you take some, some bond developer, banker decides that it's a really good idea to, to go down to a southern state. I won't pick on Alabama, but they ended up, they ended up uh, somebody, somebody proposed a great idea about a bunch of years ago to take dead chickens and they were going to raise a bunch of millions of dollars through a public offering. This is, this is, I mean, there's tons of bad stuff that gets filtered out in the muni bond market that never sees the light of day. But there's always, you know, the boondoggle that you remember, the stuff that you said, you know, either you invested in it or happily avoided it. Fortunately, today we try to avoid as many of those as we can. But where you're turning, you're turning dead chickens into into dog food, and you're requiring rural farmers to go ahead and rent a freezer at the back of their farm to collect the dead chickens through through some government entity in Alabama, and they were and the government entity is picking up the, the dead chickens and going to turn them into dog food and the revenue from the dog food is going to repay the bonds. You know what? That's not even a slow moving train wreck. That's a disaster. One of the bond deals that absolutely tickles me today uh, as being the worst muni bond deal that I've ever seen. And it's interesting because I hear about Edinburgh or Edinburgh, Texas. I see it in the news because it's where it's right on the border of Mexico, and I'm not going to get into politics. But what I find really fascinating is a bunch of knuckleheads in the muni bond business of probably a decade or two. I, I can't remember. But the basic premise was that the folks that were seeking freedom um, across the coming across the border from Mexico, the, the muni bond deal was premised on the idea that folks coming across the border were going to take a water ride at the water park, and the revenues from the water park we're going to repay some type of industrial development revenue bond in Edinburgh, Texas. Um, and obviously, the folks coming across the border in Mexico, they're not coming to take a water park ride. They're going on to other things. Don't invest in what you don't understand. Don't invest in novel concepts. We, as portfolio managers, are going with the tried and true.